Hello everyone and welcome to the Video Gadgets Journal, connecting you with your technology. This is the Google Motorola Nexus 6 and the question is, how can you tell if this device has any notifications? At the end of the day, and of course at the beginning of the day, one of the most important things that your mobile device will do is tell you whether you have any notifications. And that technology has been evolving over the last couple of years. But how does the Nexus 6 tell you if you have any notifications? Well, this is your answer. But can you tell what I actually did to get those notifications to appear on the screen? I didn't look as if I pressed any buttons and there were no gestures or motions from me. What I simply did was pick up the device. And by doing so, it actually shows you information on screen. Beyond the sheer scale of an Nexus 6, this is one of the device's party pieces and it's called Ambient Display. You simply pick up the device and it turns on to give you notifications but doesn't necessarily unlock the device. Now it works on the principle that you haven't picked up the device for a while so if you keep picking it up like this after a couple of seconds of interval it won't do anything. However, if you leave it for a longer period of time, say around 10 seconds, that's when the ambient sensor, so to speak, kicks in again. So when you pick it up, it will display information to you. Generally speaking, as you can see in this video, it works quite well and is well behaved. In order to turn this feature on or off, you do have to go to settings and then choose display and there is a toggle to switch on ambient display or not. But here is the huge caveat. If you compare it to all the technology, is it any better? Are they trying to reinvent a wheel that doesn't need reinventing? Well, this is the Nexus 6 side by side with a Galaxy S4. Both have notifications, but unless I actually do something interactive with my Nexus 6, I will never know I have a notification. On the other hand, the Galaxy S4 has this very helpful LED notification light in the top left hand corner. So even if I leave the room and then return, I can notice within a couple of seconds from the flashing light that I have a notification. Unless I do something with an Nexus 6, I'm never going to know, which seems a little regressive in terms of technology. Side by side against the Galaxy S4 and the Nexus 7, both have notification lights, but the Nexus 6 will never tell me that I have a notification. Now you could argue that I'm having another whinge about wanting my cake and eating it. All the technology from all the manufacturers all combined into one device. But what really irks me about this particular issue is that the Nexus 6 apparently does have a notification light as you can see in this picture. That's right folks, the technology is actually there in the Nexus 6. Out of the box, however, there doesn't seem to be any way to access it. Now, whether Google or Motorola pulled this feature because it's not quite compatible with the Android Lollipop operating system remains to be seen. They could reintroduce it later. The only way to currently access this LED notification light is to do something called a root on your device, which in layman's terms is like uninstalling an operating system from your laptop and then putting something else on or the same system with special privileges. To do this requires some technical confidence and I've never seen the need to do it with previous Android devices, but for the first time, I'm actually considering routing my device in order to gain access to things that I should have access to. I mean, this is Android. You should have the freedom to do whatever you want. And the Nexus 6 with these pictures teases you to something that's there, but you don't have access to. So unless things change or you have the confidence to root your device, you're stuck with ambient display, which in my personal opinion is not as good as an LED notification light. It just always tells you when you have something that you need to read. Thank you for watching the latest journal of the Nexus 6 on the Video Gadgets Journal. By all means, get involved in the conversation, like this video and don't forget to subscribe.